Hi, I'm Aisha. You are watching Educational Hub. In this video, we are going to learn that how you can find the variables in your research topic and then how you can develop the conceptual framework with the help of AI tools. So, first you have to log in the Google AI Studio. This AI tool will help you to brainstorm the ideas and to find the right direction of your research topic. This is by Google and this is totally free. So, here you have to feed this tool first about what you know about your topic and at which step you are stuck in and after that you can move forward. For example, I just know the title of my topic and I feed this tool. I want to see the effect of social media on decisions while selecting the visiting places in Dubai. This is my research topic. List the variables, which can help me to answer my research question and align with my research proposal. So Google is studio will go thinking process while developing the variable and organizing the key categories, structuring the variables and expanding variable definitions, finalizing the variable framework. So, it will work on the query step by step and will come up with the best options which can be explored in that specific area. So these are the variable categories independent, dependent and mediating variables. So first you have to know about the definition and the concepts of the variable. These are the abbreviations which you can use while talking about these variables in your studies. After that you have to move forward to selecting the variables. So, the social media influence is the independent variable and platform usage, content characteristics, visual causes and engagement metrics are the key areas which need to be focused while explaining these independent variables. Then again we would talk about the depending variable the decision-making outcome then awareness and discovery attitude and perceptions behavior intentions and final choices and these again subcategories which are being influenced by when we talk about the depending variables and these are the mediating variable the psychological why and these are the key areas which need to be focused while building a connection between depending and independent between depending and independent variables. So when you have done with the selection and uh these are the moderating or control variables who and when with travel demographics travel psychographic travel motivation trip characteristics and information sources how you have to use these variables you will get all the details concepts and the application of these variables. So now when you have done with the selection of the variables you can use this tool to define the structure of the conceptual diagram. So help me to draw the conceptual framework based on the above studies for my studies or for my PhD studies or for my research proposal. And again you will get detailed instruction from Google AI Studio. That how you can draw the conceptual framework structuring the guide content crafting clear examples. Structuring the examples and expand the view model thought. These are the tips for drawing your framework. You can use softwares like PowerPoint. Google Slide are free versions available of List Chart or Canva to create a clean professional looking diagram. You should keep it clean. You should limit it clearly. Start with a sample and align with your uh questions. You can even uh copy all this and you can use chat GPT free version create that image and you have to put the instructions. This is the framework you have to follow. Understand the basic concepts, boxes. Arrows you have to draw, then you have to go for the dependent, independent variables. How to draw the framework. Step 1 why the mediating variables, then you have to put them here and step 4 is this and this is the generating co So, this is the very concise very clear up to the mark conceptual framework which chat GPT draw for me in few minutes just by using the code or the instruction which I have developed by using the Google AI Studio. So, you can see that the content type and the content source, platform use, psychological driver. These are the independent variables and these are the mediating variables and this is the depending variables and they are interrelating with this moderating variable. And as you can see this is a very high quality image and very up to the mark and and very good for those who are struggling to draw a perfect conceptual framework for their studies. So, for those who are new in social sciences, and found hard to draw the conceptual framework. For their studies they can use these tools for brainstorming for getting ideas, and for making their concepts more clear. You can download this image in a high quality, 
and can upload in your document just by using the upload feature. And as you can see this is a very high quality image and very up to the mark and and very good for those who are struggling to draw a perfect conceptual framework for their studies. Thank you for watching, like share and subscribe my channel for more informative videos.